Good morning. How are you? Habari ya subuhi. It's a beautiful day. It rained the whole night actually here in Nairobi. I learned something last night which of course I wanted to share with you today. There are three things, liabilities, that you should avoid in your 20s if you want to be rich and if you want to avoid poverty. Are you ready? One is, you know, avoid wasting your time on trivial things. Time is an asset if you use it properly. But if you use it in, in a very unproductive way, you waste your time. Time will become a liability. Many people waste so much time, maybe five hours, social media, news, and many other unproductive activities. Does it? Hmm. Why not use your time by reading, by the way? Personally, uh, I travel a lot okay, in the past. Uh, in the airport, if you have two hours waiting for your flight, you can use that two hours, you know, maybe to read, uh, to finish one or two chapters of a book. If I am in a meeting, I am stuck in traffic. I use my time productively by reading books or maybe listening to audio books if we are driving. There are only four books that you can read, by the way. Uh, one, biography books. So rich people read biography books. Another book is uh, history books, self-help books, and novels. So these are the four books that rich people read. So one, the first thing that you need to avoid in order to be rich is to waste your time on trivial things. The second uh, liability that you need to avoid is to expect too much from other people. I think it's about time that uh, we need to rely on ourselves, on our talents and our skills. Okay? Stop making excuses. Okay? Stop blaming other people. Stop blaming the government, our politicians, our parents, and many other people. Of course, I'm not saying that uh, we shouldn't be connected with other people. But, you know, ex stop expecting too much. Focus on the things that you can do. Focus on the things that you can change. Rather than making excuses, rather than complaining. So for young people in your 20s, one of the liabilities that you can do is to expect too much from other people. The third is avoid, you know, working too hard for the degree and for money. Do you know that there are many highly educated people who are poor, helpless, and desperate? <laughs> I even read the book of, you know, Robert Kiyosaki when he talked about PhD holders, you know. Poor, P, helpless, and desperate PhDs. You know, if you only work hard because you wanted to get the degree and then nothing more from your education except your certificate, uh, you really did not gain anything. I hope that when you went to, went to a university, you know, focus more on building, not only getting the degree, not only getting the paper qualification, but developing leadership skills, understanding human behavior, understanding organizations, you know, understanding the market, things like that. And I hope that the best skill, or, you know, take away from your degree is your ability to learn new things. There are many people, after their education, they start being uneducated. You know what I mean? <laughs> I repeat, there are many people, after they complete their education, they started being, you know, their, their journey of being uneducated. In fact, I saw many master's degree holders, PhD degree holders, you know, 
the master's thesis and their PhD thesis were their first and last research. So for young people, by the way, avoid working too hard to get that degree, but rather focus on maybe while at, at the university, focus on developing your leadership skills, your communication skills, your people skills, and build connection. Huh? Uh, widen your, your network. That's why my, in the MBA, if you come to the MBA only because you wanted to get the degree, the MBA, it's really expensive. But if you come to do the MBA because you wanted to widen okay, your network to know more people, okay, to network with other people, I think it's a very good reason to come to do the MBA. And of course, there are many young people stop working too hard for the money. You know, if the only reason why you're working in that company is because of the money, okay, it's a liability that you can make, okay, can, that you can do. You need to avoid that one. So in your 20s, oh yeah, you have everything by the way. Time is your greatest asset. Do not focus so much on the money. Focus on the opportunity to learn and to grow. Three advice that I can give to our people, young people in their 20s. Avoid these liabilities if you want to be rich. Right? One, avoid wasting your time on trivial things. Your time is your greatest asset. Use it productively. Number two, avoid expecting too much from others. And number three, avoid working too hard for the degree and for the money. So, I hope I managed to share something useful again today. Please like and comment down below. And uh, yeah, I'll try to make more videos like this in the coming days. So, enjoy the rest of your day. Tumsifu Yesa Christo, milele na milele, amina. Mungu awa bariki. May God bless us all. Kwaheri, bye. And God bless.